Hello everyone, welcome back to my YouTube channel. It has been a couple of weeks since I last recorded RPG Maker MZ. I was going to record it last weekend, but there were some potential storms heading my way and I didn't want to risk recording this in particular in case I got hit with a power outage or a nice little um, spinny snake thing known as tornadoes. So I didn't want to risk losing all my data on my flash drive. So I, again, I did not record this. I did, however, record some Fallout 4 next gen update. I forgot how fun Fallout 4 was. Holy crap. <clears throat> I did have some minor issues getting it to work. My fault, I did not know that you had to turn off weapon debris for PC version or else it will crash the game. I did not know this. <laughs> Does not matter to me, honestly. You know, if it's on or not, I don't care. I played it on console first. So having that extra neat feature, buggy or not, does not bother me at all. And I also, um, I learned something. For some freaking reason, I don't know why, but let's say I want to open up my project from this folder. It won't do it. No matter what I choose, it won't do it. I literally have to do this to get it to open. This is the only way. So even if I have this folder on my desktop, it won't work. I have to open it this way. With VX Ace, however, it works just fine. I don't know why. It's so weird. If anyone else who does watch this video, and if you also use MZ, do you have the same issue? Because I can make a copy or I can drag the file from the USB onto my desktop, same thing. I get the same error. But with VX Ace, was this two versions older? Doesn't happen. Same developers too. Now it could be that it's a way to prevent you from using the engine without internet, which I don't agree with. And by that I mean where you're logged out of Steam, which I don't agree with. They need to change that. I know that was a thing a while back to where you could do that. To where you could actually open up, you know, double, you know, multiple versions of it. And that could be why. But I don't agree with that. With that decision. Because what's the harm in opening up double of the same thing? I mean, a game I can see. But this is not a game. It's a software. What's the harm in opening up two of these and working on two projects? Like, there's no harm at all. Like, whatsoever. Because I can literally just do this and it may not work. Yeah, it didn't work. Or before, I knew it would. It's, it's so weird. Oh yeah, I wasn't supposed to show this, but whatever, who cares. I said last time I wasn't going to show this, but I made some more progress. It's not much. Got a long ways to go. I don't know how much more longer I have on this map. Probably another month. Knowing my luck. If you guys do want to see me work on this map, I don't mind showing that progress. But I would, I figured I would show the actual, like, what I consider internal stuff. Even though it's not really the true internal stuff. The actual coding, like JavaScript, that's the true internal stuff. I got no clue how to do that crap. If you're watching this to see me code JavaScript, you're out of luck. Coding gives me a headache. I'm sorry. 
I'm not here to do this shit. Or, well, do that shit. I'm here to do what I know how to do as best as I can. I've tried to learn how to code. I can't even code Ruby code, and that's what VXAC uses. The most I can do is change true false statements and change numbers. That's all I can do. Trying to find those same true false and number statements in JavaScript is a bitch. I'm sorry. I will have to do it, however, later on to fix some text errors because right now as it stands I can make some text play the play play the game itself as a test and just hold a, like say A or X for Xbox and and Sony and it will just skip through all the text. I don't want that. I'm going I want to do what I can to fix that. I've done it before with JavaScript and it was let's just say I wanted to in my own life because it was a nightmare. I was on the verge of literally just yeah. It was it was that bad. That's how bad I am at coding. Trying to figure that out. So but I will do it because let's just say I don't like people who speedrun games. Speedrunning in my opinion is a no no. Just saying. I don't agree with it. People who speedrun, they take the fun out of playing games. Just my opinion. You know, just saying. As a person who has played games for most of their lives and now is making one as a developer, I frown upon speedrunning. Have I ever done it before? No. I'm not going to. However, as a game, as a as a gamer, finding bugs in games is actually quite hilarious. I would not mind playing a game that is nothing but a buggy mess. I would not mind that at all. <laughs> it might honestly be quite an enjoyment enjoyment to see. Now, would I do that? Given my skills, what I have now. Probably not. I need I need more, more um, more knowledge on what I'm doing. But seeing an actual like, actual like good game come out and it's nothing but a buggy mess on purpose, I want that. I want that. All right. So I think I left off. Yeah, I was doing this stuff. I was making the items to heal the bad effects or states, well, statuses. They need to change this from states to statuses because this is not America. This is statuses or stats or let's just rename this from stat from states to ailments. Yeah, to ailments. Just, yeah. Again, the American language is so grand. All right. My phone went off. Yeah, I wonder what it is. It could be important. I got rid of Facebook Messenger, because apparently you don't need it anymore, which is awesome. More space on my phone. Hell yeah. Oh, it's my friend sending me an attachment. I will check it out later. Again, okay. I got a message on Facebook. You don't need it anymore for Messenger. I love that. Thank you, Facebook. Thank you, Facebook. You can always send and receive messages in the actual Facebook app itself. Thank you. All right, so we made items, we made eye drops. I was looking up different names for yeah, I, I was doing that. I was looking up um, alternate names for. Yeah. This yeah okay yeah this is my yeah okay yeah that's what I was doing. This is to wake people up. This is for the flu. I could name it. Mm. 
Do I want to do that? <clears throat> no. I mean, honestly, I don't care. I'm the, I'm the developer. Who cares? Um. Now nah, I'll just leave it the way it is. I was thinking about changing one of the states to something funny, or well, something that I believe happened during a certain time a few years ago. If you know, you know. If you don't, you're an idiot. But I won't because it'll just piss people off. Honestly, you know what? I don't give a fuck. Suppressed will be silenced. Um. What do I want to name that, honestly? A suppressed cough drop. Yeah, I was in a cough drop, wasn't I? I think I was. Oh, yeah, that kind of makes sense, but something I would do. What is an alternate name for a cough drop, though? I don't want to name it just cough drop. Elogens. I mean, I could name it Elogens, but that's too generic. I want something, like, unique. Like, instead of Alarm Clock, I have Time Bomb. Instead of, um, hold on, what is this one? Instead of, instead of, um, smelling salts, I have incense. Because smelling salts is too generic. I'm sorry, like, it really is. Instead of, um, oh, yeah, um, dope and, yeah, glue. Apparently glue can be called this. Who would have thought? Instead of antivirus, we got a different name for it. Unfortunately, this one does not have one. I mean, I could name it COVID shot. Because <laughs> they're basically giving that now for this. I guarantee they are. Um, let's see here. Yeah, let's, let's, let's do that. I also switched to um, Firefox because Chrome was giving me issues. I'm trying to watch YouTube videos and Chrome's like, Nope, we're going to do an aw snap error. So I don't know what was going on with that, but whatever. <coughs> that and plus with, you know, Chrome going to be doing the update to hurt um, ad blockers one day, if not already. Might as well switch to something better. Um. Yeah. Alternate. See, I don't want to use this lozenge. I want to do something else. Oh, no, 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 no. Now I'm not getting the same results. Son of a biscuit. Um, hold on. Cinnamon. It's not Cinnamon? C Cinnamon Toast Crunch? No. Cinnamon... Is that how you spell it? Cinnamon? What? Whorehound? What the fuck? Dude! You want some whorehound? <laughs> Try walking up to a woman saying that. It wouldn't work. You get slapped. I'm taking it. I love it. That is so unique. Yes. I'm taking it. I love it. I've never heard of Horham before. That is amazing. I have never heard it before. I love it. No, hold on. Whorehound, um... Ah, crap. I want a cracker. Whorehound... Whorehound juice. Yeah. Yeah. What else is that? <gasps> Tea. Hmm. I did not. Wait, hold on. Did they put it in cough? Cheer up. No way. No way. Did they really put it in cough syrup? I'm curious now. Hold on. I'm curious now. Sorry, Vix. Not sponsored.
They're not showing the ingredients. They're legally supposed to. Oh, Vicks, you dirty butts. <laughs> <laughs> Mystery juice. <laughs> we could do rat poison. <laughs> Whorehound, dude, that's a. Is it actually pronounced whorehound? I'm curious now. Hold on. Hold on. Oh. Yeah, I know it. I think it is. Whorehound. Yeah, no, it is. <laughs> yes. <laughs> I love it. Oh, that's grand. You want some whorehound juice? What? Smack. <laughs> I was asking if you wanted some cough drop medicine. What? And say that. Yeah, makes sense. We'll use the tea kettle. Um, hold on, hold on, um, I gotta think of, uh, uh this one will remove, what am I yawning for, like, seriously? Son of a monkey's uncle. I hit the wrong key. Damn it. Oh well. I still can't believe there's something called Whorehound. That, that's just grand. The, the interesting stuff you find when you're making a video game. <laughs> Whatever. I don't care. And or or in on that's not fit. I'm using um idiot speak here. I don't want to say if I want to use idiot speak. I can use papega or whatever. Like those are not real terms. Stop. I have a cough and or cannot speak. <laughs> oh my god, dude. Nope, it won't fit. Try some... Um, what else? What else? I, I want it to fit. Try out some... No. Try out some... No. Whorehound juice. Usable? Usable only in battle. Oh, that's freaking perfect. I'm happy with that. Next state is... Berserk. Oh, that would be a good item for Berserk. It's kind of a douchey move, but the cure for Berserk can be, um, knocked out. Yeah, I mean, knocked out. Then you have to use another item 
to wake him back up from being knocked out. <clears throat> or, instead of that, I mean, that, that could work. Hmm. Let's see, that could work. Or... I can maybe make it to where it's a skill. Like a magic skill or a physical skill. That knocks them out. I mean, I could do that as well, honestly. Like, it doesn't matter. But. Ooh, actually. No, if I did that. Yeah, no, that wouldn't work either. Um. Remove by damage. Hold on. Oh, I can make it a chance. I kind of like the idea where I use an item to set the knocked out status. I could do remove by damage, but then I would count for enemies as well. To where if they hurt you, you have a chance to lose this status. Even if they're the ones that put it on you. Because I'm not sure. I've, I've never really dove in to what I'm doing now. Like, I've made... I've made stuff like this before. I've made weapons and items before and armors. But I've never really dug into, like, how far can I go with it? What all can I do with all of this stuff? Can I make it to where X works with Y? Or why works with A, or so on and so forth. I've not done any of that at all. <clears throat> I've even made my own states. I've never done like most. Of what I would do with my own states is I would just take death, poison, so on and so forth. I wouldn't make anything, you know, like unique. Like I wouldn't have suppressed. This would be silent. This would be. I wouldn't even have this at all. I, w I wouldn't have bleed. I wouldn't have influenza. I would have sleeping. And it would still be on this right here. I would have blind. I would have charm. Basically what this is. There's a different name for it. Like I wouldn't have anything you know, unique at all. But since I'm recording this for YouTube. And I want to actually make a game. That is my own design for freaking finally once in my whole freaking life. I figured, you know what? Let's make everything unique. Let's change things up. I still find this hilarious. <laughs> Who would have thought? Oh, <laughs> um, yeah, so I actually like that idea. Now I could just have it, you know, be generic to where Berserk wears off on its own. That's what I've seen in other games. Like you get the Berserk status and there's no cure for it. 
as far as I know. Maybe there is. I don't know. But I'm not like other developers. It's my game. I want to be unique with it. So. And I could even change. Actually, you know what? Hold on. Let's find a unique name for for this. Why the heck not? It is not, you know. I could do Demented. Out of one's mind. And that's me right there. According to the government. Nice. I could do... Oh, I could do Hysteria. <gasps> oh. There are more. There is. Enraged. And eh, that's the same thing. Uh -huh. Wound up. War. Frantic. Maniac. Manacle. Amek. Or Amok. I'm sorry, but that should be a U, not an O. Is that really all there is? There is more. Okay. Madly? Yeah, that's a being a U, not an O. Like a muck. Um, a muck. That's um, a mock, not a muck. Heedlessly? Haywire, agitatedly, desperately. Okay, yeah, there's a muck. And then there's a mock. What's the definition? Variance or a muck. Um, this is not a muck. This is a mock. There's an O there. O makes an O, an ah sound, not an uh sound. I'm sorry. American language, you are freaking drunk. Go home. Pell mell. You know what? Fuck it. Found our word. <laughs> we found it. <laughs> Whatever, dude. I love it. We're using it. Unless. Hold on. Breathtaking. Where do people get these freaking words from? This means this. Where do people get these words from? I swear. Like, whoever thought of pell mell needs to be slapped in the freaking face. Just say they're hurried. Okay, I'll, I want to see this in a sentence. I want to see this in a sentence. On Black Friday, many, many people engage in a massive pell mell that it can be very dangerous. Like, that makes no sense. Where do people get these words from? In a massive, disorderly manner is what it has to be referring to. Like... <clears throat> Where do people get the... Okay, hold on. Hold on, hold on, hold on. I wonder when this word... When was this word made up? Not Paul Mall.
Like when, like, when can you tell that when a word was made up? Like the year and all of that shit. It was made up last year. Recent examples. It was made up last year. So it's a newer word. No, okay. 1950. That's since one. So apparently it's been around since the 50s. What am I just now hearing about it? My god, dude. Whoever invents these words needs to be freaking slapped. I'm sorry. I'm using it. Whatever, dude. No, I'm not going to. Hold on. That word makes no freaking sense. I'm sorry. Hold on. Um, We're taking this one. I don't care. Probably not makes no fucking sense. I'm sorry. I don't care if the person who invented it is long freaking dead because apparently it was made in the 50s. We need to dig him up and slap him in the face. Because it makes no fucking sense. <laughs> it makes no goddamn sense at all. So what do I want for this icon? Now that we finally have a new word for berserk. Which is basically just another generic word. Because pell mell makes no sense, I'm sorry. I ain't using it. I'll freaking use whorehound though, that's freaking hilarious. That's some hilarious shit right there. <clears throat> Is there a fan icon? Hold on, hold on, hold on. A paper fan. We can do some slapstick comedy like they do in Japan. I don't see one. Damn it. Dang it. I'm gonna kill scoured internet for one, but I don't wanna mess all this stuff up. I don't wanna get any um copyrighted things. I can with the fish. Rubber fish. Um let's see here. I mean that can work too. Head him over to have a newspaper. <laughs> I could do that actually. Newspaper. Someone in your party to got the dementia. Head him over to head with it with this. <laughs> Fuck it, you know what? I'm doing it. I love it. Is there a better icon though than this? Hold on. No, I can do a book. Oh. I can do a book. Oh, but hold on, hold on. If I, if I do a book, I have to be a dick about it. Hold on. I like being a dick. Okay, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Oh, dude. Hold on. Is that ice? Huh. Must be. Where's, where's the thickest book I can possibly find? And no, I don't mean thick as in like Multiple C's. I mean, thick spelled correctly with a CK at the end, you freaking idiots. Okay, you know what? We'll go for the red one. Now, hold on. I got a choice to make. I got a choice to make. Do I just call it a book? Or do I call it the Holy Bible? And piss off everyone in the world. Well, no, piss off everyone in America.
Oh, unless they piss off the Christians. <laughs> I could do that. But... I'm not going to. Even though I really want to. <laughs> However, would it be the actual Holy Bible? You know, that we have today. No, it would not. But it would still piss off the Christians in real life. Because, yes, it would. And I, I mean, as much as I really want to, I'm not going to. <clears throat> However, there will be a Holy Bible in the game. Not that one. A different one. Just so you know. So before any of you get all uppity and start, you know... In the comments below, no, I'm not going to rewrite your book. Don't worry. I know better. Though I would, if I could, I would, but I'm not going to. Basically, I would, I'm not even going to say that part, honestly. I'm not going to say nothing on that one. Nope. Nope. I'm done. No, I'm done. Nope. I'm done. Never mind. Now what to name this thing? Um, because it is a book. <laughs> Egg Scrambler. <laughs> Egg Scrambler. <laughs> Egg Scrambler. <laughs> God damn it, I love it. <laughs> Brain Scrambler? No, I mean... I mean, honestly, Egg Scrambler sounds better. <laughs> Egg Unscrambler? Brain? Uh, no, that doesn't fit. Damn it, what do I call it? I could do Egg Scrambler. I'm st Egg Scrambler still fits. Actually, I need to change the name of something real quick. Hold on. There we go. <laughs> Dementia. <laughs> Instead of Demented, I'll just do that. Because, I mean, technically, it fits because... Oh, no, hold on. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Uh, now this would technically be... Actually, hold on, you know what? Hold on, hold on. I have this all backwards. Actually, no. I could do that. You can have dementia. And then... Attack anyone. And then... Yeah, I can have two of them do that. Love struck And Dementia. But this one gives you buffs. So you're in a berserk state. You're not yourself. Well, you know, you have Dementia. You forgot who your friends are. You have all these buffs and debuffs. And you attack anyone. You forgot who your friends are and then, yeah, I love that. With this one, you're just charmed and you attack anyone. Because you're, no. 
allies only. I love that. Yeah, 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 yeah. So we have dementia with all these buffs and debuffs. Attack anyone. And then we have charm. Yeah, I love that. That is so nice. Okay. Um. Yeah, okay, I'm not feeling the book. I mean, I, I like the book idea, but... What's that I had an IV droplet? No, no, you know what's good at the book. Um... Screw it, I want to do egg scrambler, because it, it's just hilarious. I love it. And it kind of fits, too, because you're hitting over the head. No, hold on. Well then. Scramble. Oh, no, I don't think it'll fit. No, it won't. Have no fear. Have no fear. Usable only in. Yeah, okay, now it fits. So, one ally, consume, yes. Bathwain only, Bathwain only, yes, okay. And where's the um, uh, states? Okay. So now we got scorched, um, we're gonna do. Burn cream, I guess. I could have a different name for burn cream. Hold on. Um, burn cream, cream, really? I mean, that's just you know. Well, nothing there. Okay, well, we're going to see with burn cream then because, I mean, you know, whatever then. There are no alternate names for it. Burn cream! This one removes dementia. Nice. Egg scrambler. <laughs> I love it. I love it. I don't know, I'm not really feeling the book. But the book kind of makes sense because you, you know, you got to scream with your brains. I have a frying pan. <gasps> Ooh. I don't think I do. No, I don't see one. Damn it, dude. Yeah, I guess I'll use the book then. Whatever, dude. It's fine. It's fine. Actually, no, hold on. Screw it. <laughs> this hammer will fix them. <laughs> oh, that's awesome.
Someone in your party losing their mind? Have no fear. This hammer will fix them. Use a bolt only in battle. <laughs> now, however, however, hold on, hold on, hold on. Um. I'll do this too. Cause you are hitting him on the head. So so it makes sense for him to lose health. And then hold on, hold on. It removes state dementia. You hurt them, then it will add state. Knocked out. You hurt remove state, they lose health. They get knocked out status. Then you have to do another item to get them back up from knocked out. I like it. And actually, I might do 10% health instead. Yeah, I love it. I like that idea. I'm going to save it real quick. Yeah, that makes sense because it is a hammer. And then they get knocked out. So yeah, you have a choice, and it doesn't say here that it hurts me. It's you gotta find out on your own kind of kind of thing. People might think it's a bug, but it's not. <laughs> I love it. Okay. Um. Burn cream. State, remove state. Scorched, 100%. <clears throat> I'm gonna go ahead and just do, let's use this one as a placeholder for now. Frigid. Immobilizes shock and then love struck. Okay, so we're almost done. And once we're done, we'll go ahead and put a cut in this video. This is probably all I'm going to do today. I, mean, I, I could do more, but. Yeah, immobilize and then love struck. Okay. Immobilize and then love potion. Paste and then. No. Copy, freeze, immobilize, and then left potion. Paste. Clear this one. Okay. Um. What is a good name for something that? I don't think we have an actual, like, real-life medicine that gets rid of frostbite, do we? I mean, other than, like, a bunch of blankets and keeping it warm. I don't think we have an actual, like... We might, I don't know. I'm not a medical professional, so I don't know if we do. All I can think of right now is, like... Warm the body up as much as possible. Maybe not. Maybe not too quick. Uh, let's see here. What do we? Hmm. I don't really want this icon either because it doesn't really fit. I mean, it could fit. Yeah, no, I guess it could fit. And then I need a name. So I have burn cream, frigid cream. It doesn't really fit. Hold on. Um.
a gas on. Out of curiosity. First medication. So there really is not one. Okay. I was right. There is not really medication. Huh. Is there a blanket? No, not really. Hmm. A good way to remove... So I have, okay, burn cream, which is going to get rid of burns, or... Yeah, so what's a good way to get rid of... Huh. What is a good item name for this? Freeze cream? Frostbite cream? I, I could ask Bard for some ideas, but it may not work. Screw it, why not? Let's try it. Because I am drawing a blank. Come on, Bard. I mean, come on, Gemini. Are you down? Is my internet down? No, hold on. Is my internet down? Uh. Guess I'll go here real quick. Bard's down. Okay, well then. That is interesting. Let's see. You know what, Colin? Oh, let's do this. Screw it. Because I got nothing else. And I'll probably just change this later on. Who knows? I don't know. So we'll really just use a candle. It's something easy. Yeah, probably generic, but I mean, I'll more than likely change it later. <coughs> if not, I don't care. Um, let's see here. Hold. Cold and unable to move. All right. Now for immobilize. Okay. Now I didn't change this one to this. Okay, there we go. I'm not setting a price yet for any of these because I'm leaning towards a crafting system or making it to where these are only found um, obtainable from 
monster drops. However, instead of a typical monster drop, a... How to explain this? Think of something like Dragon's Dogma, where every chest is randomized. Was I was I love, I love that idea, but to where the enemies drop that a, a, a chest because again there are unfortunate limitations on what they can drop. So I'll have one item, like literally being the chest, and that chest has a loot table for all the items in it that I want in there, and that will be a a big. A common event that the chest draws upon when the player goes into their inventory to open the chest. Unfortunately, you'll have to go in your inventory and open it up. I know, tedious, but that's the only way to do it. That's the only way to make it to where the items are truly randomized. So, there's no other way to do it. Unfortunately, I can sprinkle some chests, you know, in the maps themselves that do the same thing. But if I want drops to be randomized, it has to be an item you actually open from the inventory, <coughs> which is unfortunate. I can maybe make it to where it automatically opens it, but I am not sure if that's possible. And that might require scripting, maybe? I don't know. Or, well, let me say, like, plugins or, you know, coding JavaScript. And I have no knowledge in, in any of that stuff. So, and if it does, eh, whatever. Sure, you'll, you'll have to run it over and over again. If I can maybe put like an NPC in there or whatever to allow you to do it multiple times, that's what I'll do. Or if I make it to where you hit one, an option comes up to where you do it X amount of times, that's what I'll do as well. But I don't know if that's possible. I've actually made one of these before on this engine before I switched back to VX Ace. And I got it working perfectly. So, but I never did implement a way to allow you to open up multiple at once. That was my next step, actually. <laughs> Before I switched back to VXACE because of lack of a certain feature that should have been in the program since day one of release. So, yeah. It is what it is. Immobilize, immobilize, immobilize. You know what? This looks like a flask. I don't condone alcohol, but you know what? Screw it. This one time. Immobilize. We're gonna make alcohol. What is the strongest alcohol in the world? Because, frick it, I don't care. It's like it new. 96% alcohol! Holy shit! Okay! I don't know if I can name it that or not, but... Damn, dude! Drink one of those and you're freaking wasted. Holy shit, dude. <laughs> That's awesome. Okay, dude, we're doing, we're doing a freaking vodka. This will get rid of paralysis for sure, dude. Shit. <laughs> Hold on, hold on, hold on.
96%. Is it 96% proof? Or... Yeah, 96%. No, I'll, I'll just do, I'll just do, yeah. <laughs> that is a high content. Oh my god, dude. Oh my god. Oh my god. Actually, no, instead of um, vodka, we'll say like liquor. Because it can be whatever the player wants it to be. Did I spell that right? I don't think I did. So a bitch. I was right. I did not spell right. <laughs> Holy shit, dude. <laughs> yeah, that will get rid of paralysis for sure, dude. Oh my god. Oh, and I, now I gotta add a drunk status. <sighs> Hold on. Now I can... This right here. Poison. Alcohol poisoning. Yeah. Yeah, I know that fits. That fits. We're, we're good. We're good. It fits perfectly. Because it's 96% proof. Then you get poisoned. And you have a chance to get... That's perfect. We're set. <coughs> and then it had... Yeah. And then it'll do... Add state. Poison. Or move to mobilize, but it adds poison at the same time. Because, I mean... Obviously. That's perfect. And then you'll lose health and then you have a chance to die as well because, you know, you're drunk. That's perfect. And there's no point in making a different stat for it either. Because it would be the same thing. Just a different name, same icon. So there's no point. Oh, I freaking love that. Yeah, I love it. 96% alcohol. Holy shit, dude. One swig of that and you are toasted. No wonder the Russians can live where they live when it's cold. <laughs> Damn. <laughs> Damn, dude. That, oh my god. Oh my god, dude. That has to taste so bad, though, because of the alcohol. Like, I've only had, like, alcohol that has 2 or 3% in it. Maybe five, okay, maybe ten percent as well, and I did not care for the taste of it whatsoever. That has to taste so bad. Oh, oh, yeah. No wonder the Russians can live where they live when it's cold. That keeps them nice and warm. Oh. <laughs> Um, oh, I have the perfect description for this. Yeah, hold on now. If only this worked in real life. Paralyzed.
So you now, if anyone has, you know, unfortunately lost someone due to an accident, or you've been in an accident involving this crap right here, which is why I don't condone it. You know where I'm getting at when it's said when I'm putting drink this so you can live right up. Because for some freaking reason, alcohol makes the person who is behind the wheel limber as hell. And they always get out without any injuries from an accident. It blows my mind. And if you have lost someone or you've been in an accident with involving this crap, my condolences. Like my, my sincere condolences because this shit, in my opinion, needs to be illegal. It is the worst shit out there right now versus cigarettes or weed. Now, I mean, granted, there are worse drugs out there, I agree. But this shit is bad. <clears throat> hit apply and hit OK. Save it. And that's where I want to leave off for now. I may or may not do one more tonight or... Well, I'll do one tomorrow, of course. I'm also going to, again, switch my schedule for recording this from my four-day weekend. Was you would think, why are you doing that? Well, I want to. I have support staff on Mondays, Tuesdays, and Thursdays. I worked on, well, I didn't today. I work on my game normally on Mondays and Tuesdays, and of course Thursdays, but Mondays and Tuesdays are back to back when I can work on it. <coughs> so since I've already worked on it when I'm out with my support staff, I might as well come home and record it as well since I'm already in the mood for it. Versus recording it when I'm not technically in the mood to over the weekend. Which, I mean, I could record it on Thursdays as well. Which, um, I, also, I will still do that. So, but I figured this might help me record it more often. Since I'm, you know, already working on it. Anyways, so... No, I will not be able to record it whenever I'm not with my, with my support staff because I will be in a public setting with other people who are like myself, who are disabled and all that stuff. So I will not be able to do that, unfortunately, which, you know, got to obey HIPAA laws and whatnot. I could possibly do it without a microphone on my laptop, but I don't have the um I don't have this installed on my laptop. So I'm not sure if I can even get it installed. I'm not sure if it's I mean it has to be possible somehow. But I'm not sure if it's possible without having a um actual GeForce video card, and my laptop does not have one, so yeah, because that's the only way I know how to record. I could do OBS, but I'd rather just have something simple to where I just have you know this installed and it's just a button press, where OBS is probably like you gotta set up all this other crap. And then a button press. I don't want to deal with that crap at all. Shadow play for, for NVIDIA is a godsend. 
why no one else uses it is beyond me. <coughs> but anyways, that's going to be it for now. If you enjoyed the content, feel free to do the usual stuff. Like, subscribe, comment, hit the bell. It will help my channel grow. And yeah, I will see you all next time. Have a wonderful day.